My reaction to Sean Strickland versus Israel Asanya. <sighs> I can't believe he did it. I mean, if you told me at any point in time I would have saw this photo as a reality, Sean Strickland damn near a few punches away from finishing Israel Asanya. Most unpredictable sport in the world. But no, Sean and Eric Nixick had a sick game plan. Stay in Izzy's face, close the distance, keep that distance tight so Izzy can't get his kicks off. And how the f he made the Philly shell work in a fight against Israel Adesanya is crazy to me. The dude did it though. Not discrediting Sean in any way. I did find it a bit odd that Izzy didn't try to change any point of the game plan even when he was down two, three rounds. But maybe Sean's pressure was just so relentless that Izzy couldn't really do anything about it. I do believe Izzy getting hurt in this first round changed the whole direction of this fight. I mean, it's so insane that Israel Asanya has competed with some of the best kickboxers in the world. And Sean's unorthodox, kind of awkward style that a lot of people don't really bring to mixed martial arts possess more problems for Israel Asanya than really anybody else has other than like Alex Pieta. Styles just make fights. It's the craziest sport in the world. Should they run it back? I honestly think after falling short like that, 4-1, to one, I don't think you should get an immediate rematch. And I'm a huge Izzy fan. But it's looking like that's what Dana White and the UFC are going to do. But it pains me to say this. But huge shout out to Sean Trickland and Eric Nixick. They absolutely deserved to win last night. I'm really curious what's going to happen next. Let me know your thoughts down below.